As she teases the return of RHOA, Kim Zalshik deletes Bierman from Instagram amid her divorce. Kim Zalshik made her Instagram separation from Croy Bierman official. After terminating her nearly 12-year marriage to the former NFL player, 37, the reality actress, 45, removed her married name from her handle as a clear indication that she is ready to move on. Her decision comes as followers of Real Housewives of Atlanta eagerly anticipate the mother of sixes return to the Bravo program in a cameo that is hinted in a season 15 promo. Zolshik, who began the show but left as a full-time housewife in season 5, and again after a brief appearance as a friend in season 10, changed her handle after doing so, tweeted a pair of pictures of herself with Lisa Wu, Sherry Whitfield, and other RHOAOGs. She captioned the picture, See you soon at BravaTV hashtag RHOA. It's hardly surprising that Zolshik wants to get rid of the name of her ex-husband. The two have been engaged in an increasingly heated divorce battle since declaring their separation last month, with Kim calling their marriage as irretrievably broken with no hope of reconciliation in her application. On May 18, Zolshik submitted a petition asking the Fulton County Superior Court to investigate whether Bierman was currently abusing drugs. She has requested that the ex-NFL player submit to a five-panel hair follicle drug screen. Her ex would have to not cut or remove any of his hair until such time as the screen is complete, according to the request. Zolshik allegedly saw Bierman smoke marijuana, and as a result, she has serious concerns for the safety and well-being of the minor children entrusted to his care, according to the documents. Kaya Rose and Kane Wren, twins who are nine years old, together with Cash Cade and Croy Jagger, sons who are 10 and 11 years old, are their younger children, and she is fearful that they will be exposed to the substance he is reportedly using. Bierman then stepped up the ante by submitting a motion for psychological evaluation, requesting that the courts investigate into Zolshik's mental health in light of an alleged gambling addiction. According to the paperwork, which were acquired by People, during the party's marriage, respondent presented very troubling behavior which has increased in the months leading up to petitioners filing for divorce. The alleged gambling addiction has allegedly financially devastated the parties, according to Bierman, who claims Zolshik acknowledged spending substantial time and marital funds on gambling and other games of chance. Respondent is unable to give the kids the care they need because she spends so much time playing online poker. Since both parents are currently in the care, custody, and control of the parties, petitioner is concerned for the safety and well-being of the children, according to the documents. In order to determine any underlying mental issues such as depression, anxiety, narcissistic personality disorder, bipolar disorder, attention deficit hyperactivity disorder or others that are manifested through respondent's compulsive gambling, and other behaviors indicative of additional addiction issues, Bierman's legal team stated that this evaluation is in the best interests of all parties. The filing's financial records reveal many payments that were made to Coinbase, a cryptocurrency exchange site. In response to the accusations, a close friend of Zolshik previously told People, she's been gambling, that's true, but she's been winning. He simply wants to make it appear as though she has been losing money.